All right. I don't know how this is going to come out because it's not like I sit around and script these things out. Mostly I think about it, and once I think about it long enough, then it becomes time to record it. So here we go. I think I got it clear in my mind now how to explain things because one of the things about watching me here at Pack Stereo TV is wondering why. What, what's the point? Why are they doing this? What What is this shit? <laughs> and, I, and, I, and I admit, I know, I agree. Hence, I'm going to try to explain it to you. Because I do have an agenda, but it's not hidden. I have a specific agenda. That agenda is internet television. And people go like, Mario, what is internet television? And so who gives a shit? What, well, let me tell you why I give a shit. Mainly because I'm 60 fucking years old. Okay, and I got all the other shit out of the way. Okay, it's all out of the way. Except the love thing, we can talk about that later. But the stuff is out of the way. By that I mean I've got enough accolade, I got the plaques on the wall and the degrees and the paper. That's all good stuff. I'm not putting it down, but you know, as a humble person, see, you don't cling to that stuff. You move forward in life. And there are those things that are always more important than self like opportunities that come around that are going to change the whole landscape of the world. That's what internet television is, and that's why I'm passionate about it, because this is not about me, it's about you. Let me make sure that's clear. This ain't about me, it's not about Mario Hemsley. This is about you. And the reason why I'm passionate about it because this is going to be one of those things in life that have such far-reaching repercussions that I feel blessed to have my hand on it. It's a calling, if you don't, for those of you who don't understand. It's a calling. I feel the overwhelming need to make you aware of opportunities available to you in internet television because I think this is the biggest happening in my lifetime, the biggest leveling of the playing field. And it excites me because I'm a child of the 60s. So things that can affect the landscape that where the little man has something, finally something, because see, this is new. This is new and that means it's new to all of us, see? So the passion in me has to do with, even though I know it's internet television, you all say, well, what the, what the hell is internet television? The fact that you can broadcast worldwide, do you understand the implications of that? I've been waiting for this shit my whole life. This is the ultimate leveling of the playing field. They've owned media forever. Now things have changed. People care more about citizen journalism than they care about CNN. You could be the reporter. They want the stories to come from the people. The phenomena is Twitter. The phenomena is Facebook. So, Mario Hemsley, at the age of 60, having gotten a bunch of his own bullshit out of the way, has recognized his calling, which is to make people aware about internet television, because a bunch of you are going to be broadcasters. We are going to speak to the world, because we finally can. And the potential of that is so far-reaching that, believe me, the structures are, that be that's they're scrambling to take control and threatened by your control. The fact that CNN and Fox and all them, they're amazed that you don't want to hear their reports, that you'd rather go to Twitter and see what people are saying about the riots or the demonstrations or the shootings or the happening. They are freaking the fuck out. Please excuse my French. I hate to be vulgar, but I get passionate. They're freaking out because you are changed your habits and your patterns. Now you want to hear from other folks. This is the revolution. So the fact that I'm here, that I'm doing this, this is my agenda. I do want something from you. I specifically want something from you. I want you to do this. I want you to do this. I want folks, I want the common man, the little man, the black man, the Latin man, everybody, the gay man, everybody who hasn't had the fair opportunity. I want you, I want women. Come on, I want, this is the time. 
to do internet television. Every school should have an internet television channel at the school, every high school. It's, in, it's, it's, it's inexpensive. The equipment is readily available. What's stopping us from doing this? Well, I'm, mentality. So Mario's here to remind you. I'm here for you. I'm here for you because my calling is to somehow make you understand this ain't about me. This is about you. Internet television, because this is what's going to allow the little man to take his place. It's a shifting of the guard. It is incredibly important. Now I got messages for two types of people. For the first ones, it's time to get off your ass. Half step and making excuses. Please. Time to get off your ass and do something. You know it. Like I said, I'm coming for you. If I'm speaking this to you and it feels like I'm reaching at you, that's because the universe has got us both tied in here at this moment. That's why I'm doing this. This is for you all. So get off your ass. Get busy. Live life aggressively with passion. Do your thing. Just do it with some passion. I'm not here to tell you what to do. You know, I haven't even attempted to tell you what kind of thing to promote. You understand that something's happening. There are a bunch of you who are going to see this and understand that I'm talking to you. Don't ignore your calling. Get off your ass. Now, for the other folks, I feel for you, because you are me. A bunch of us tired. You worked hard your whole life, raised a family, put your children through school, did everything the hard way. Hard working American folks did it. All races, gendered people doing it, struggling. For you, I bring a message of hope. Because I know you're tired, and I know you're hurting, and many days I'm tired and hurting too, and I understand. But for a bunch of you, you know you've been working on that book, or your photos, or baking your cakes, making your quilts, you good at fishing or barbecue, whatever it is. See, I don't know. And I know you're tired, but I want you to understand, struggle hard. At this point, I know I don't care if you were a publisher before, if you did it all before, and I know you're tired. I'm going to tell you now, think hard. Try hard to muster forth that last bit of energy to do this. I like the way Maxwell says it in this woman's work. I know you got a little strength in your left. I know you got a lot of strength left. I know you got a little love in you left. I know you got a lot of strength left. Because I want you to do this for you. And then you come back and tell me if it wasn't worth it. Because if you have a computer and you, you don't need anything, most of you got everything. You have to just try. You don't have to do it like pack stereo with the multi-camera shoots and all that crazy madness. I'm trying to do it like the top of the line. Because that's who Mario is. But that ain't mean you have to do everything. And the public don't care. I know one camera shoots just as popular as our multi-six camera stuff and all of Listen. I just need to ring that bell in your head. So now you under, if you question why I'm at Facebook, Twitter, I didn't want it. Half of y'all, y'all know me, I knew I dropped out years ago. One day, a lot of the things that was just going on, Seemed like a bunch of bullshit to me. And I retreated from this popular world to the world of Dr. Hemsley, where effectively I could hide, you know, make that money, and work on stuff on the down low. But like for, that gets old for me too, and I have my calling, and the universe comes after me too. So here we are, me and you. And in that television, promote what you're doing. Write the book. Start to talk to the people now. Ask Miko about the pet talks I gave her. Ask any of the folks who have come to Pack Stereo TV. They out there. Ask them what I said to them. There's some of you who know me. I've been talking this madness for years. Ask Gary Taylor when I told him in 05 I was going to go work on internet television. We came from nowhere. Over 10 million view, viewer minutes at live stream. 
multiple millions. We got multiple accounts and multiple millions of things. Who are we? I don't, maybe I told you ain't about me. I need it for people to understand why I am posting things to Facebook. Why I am sharing the memories. Because the other thing about this phenomenon, and you got to keep this clear too, is that the people care about you. So you're going to want to talk about your book or your cakes, your fly fish and your barbecue, but they're going to want to know about you. So now me and you are in the same box. I had to come out of my hole because in order to sell internet television, I had to let them know Mario Hemsley. So you're going to have to let them know you in order to sell your product. You can't hide behind the company name, Campbell's Soup. So, so Yeah, I mean, that's the, way, that's the way folks used to do it. You would give yourself a name that made it so that no one could tell you were black or brown or whatever and put your stuff out there as the business. And that was the way the model was then. The model today is they want to know you, why you wrote the book, why you make the quilt. Okay? There are people who are doing this, and I want you to know that. I'm going to slowly start to tell you as I can about the folks that I know of. But remember, I made this video because I'm sitting here scratching my head. See, I got, what do I do? Because I got an agenda. All y'all going, he got an agenda. What's Mario doing all this stuff? What, what the hell is all this stuff Mario doing? Well, now I told you. It's a battle for the hearts and mind of you, the citizens, my friends, family. I want you to do stuff for yourself. And I want you to understand it is my calling to at least make you aware. I published a show for years, Create Your Label. They tell you how to have an independent. Remember I had the broke ass musicians, bare bone budget. The broke ass, <laughs> so how to do a record label for $500. Pub, it's up there. Pub, all that's up there. I did all of that. Why? Because I've been trying to pull people toward this for a while. But when the internet television thing, it was obvious. I was getting it now. This was my calling. Because I was good at this, baby. And all the people who know me will tell you, I did parts of this years ago. But now it all comes to bear. And I'm off. And getting myself physically together dealing with my injury. But I'm off. My mind is working. So it's time to get busy. So I'm calling you out. I'm calling you out. You watching this and you watching this long and this far. Oh, I'm in your head now. Because you know this is about you. Come do your shit. Come do your shit. Pax Dara is going to try the best to show you how. What I want out of it? Well, I already got out of it. Like I told you, I'm comfortable. I'm trying to pay my dues. Thank my God for my blessings. And the way you do that is to tend his sheep. This is the gift. So when you do your book, or you tell your story, you get that, you build upon that. And then you understand that it's still the revolution that this was available to all of us. That you could be right here in Los Angeles and talk to China. All over the world. You can build a community worldwide and meet the community worldwide. That's all about the things you're about. And that's what it's about. So that's Mario's agenda. That's my plan. And so it's not manipulation if I tell you I intend to do it. I intend to impress you with what two brothers working out a converted garage here in Los Angeles can do. All of this. I'm the only web designer Pax Dale's ever had. Victor and I do all the work around here. We run all the equipment. We sweep the floors. We make the Kool-Aid. And then we are blessed to have folks like Miko who are willing to come in and work with us to do programming and make shows and do their thing. But we do the grunt work. We do the grunt work. I wired that place. Okay? Like I said, there ain't no other staff people. It's us. And that's why we think it's impressive the two brothers working alone by the grace of God can pull this off. Oh, it's, I'm calling you out because I want you to do your thing.
That's all I want out of it. You don't owe, you don't owe me a dime. Pay it forward, right? I'm just trying to place, play my role in this point in history, what I see to be a point in history, and that is certainly reward enough. I'm Mara Hensley, and I just called you out. Peace and love.